Well, bring an umbrella if you're going out tonight. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be wet out there. Brian Goddard is here with the weekend forecast. Soggy or not, though, we definitely need this rain. We do need it. Unfortunately for the parents sitting in the stands watching their kids play some football tonight, you're going to see some rain showers over the next couple hours. Downtown Port Washington, been a gray day today. You've had a few areas of drizzle and some very light rain showers. Temperature right where it should be in the lower 60s. It's damp outside as well, and that dampness creating some fog at the airport uh, at this hour. We've been talking about it, the abnormally dry conditions anywhere in yellow. Our northern county is not in that because they have been seeing enough rain over the last couple of weeks, past couple of months. Then there, of course, is the drought. South Milwaukee, Waukesha, Racine, Kenosha, and Walworth County. Now, last night's rain, anywhere from about a tenth of an inch to the north side of Milwaukee to a half inch on the south side. Most of us picked up about a quarter to a half inch rain. And I say most because down to the south, Walworth, Racine, Kenosha, hardly anything. As I mentioned, we've had a few areas of sprinkles and some light rain showers. More moving in from the southwest, still very light but it could pick up in intensity just a bit as we get into the evening hours. A lot of this coming in out of Minnesota, excuse me, out of Illinois. Minnesota is seeing the heavier downpours, and those are getting ready to move into western Wisconsin for those football games. So there will be some showers, the potential for some rumbles of thunder. Temperatures actually warming up as we go through the evening. There will be some fog, and I think the rain should be out of here for the second half. You can see some of those downpours rolling in here. Here's 8 o'clock this evening, and then they quickly move to the north. So the second half of the game hopefully is dry. May still have some sprinkles and some drizzle. Tomorrow morning, more rain showers, and that will continue off and on throughout the day into the evening. It won't rain all day, but there will be that chance throughout the day. And then for tomorrow, or for, excuse me, for Sunday, sunshine, southerly winds, and warming up. Looking for about an inch of rain out of this system by Saturday evening. Speaking of more rain, that is Nate. Currently a tropical storm with 40, or excuse me, 60 mile per hour winds near Cozumel. It will become potentially a hurricane, a Category 1 hurricane by the time it makes landfall Saturday night near Biloxi, Mississippi. We're going to have some rain tomorrow, 75 on Sunday, and then gorgeous conditions Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday.